history about the basketball and soccer game tonight as well as how you can make the special someone feel extra special and much more. It's Tuesday, February 2nd, and this is MCHlive.com News. FBLA has their February monthly meeting Thursday in room 721 at 310. The meeting will cover and discuss the region leadership conference and the competitive event result and prepare for the virtual state leadership and conference. Now let's get to Chris from an update from the FFA. FFA is having a ro rose sale on February 5th. Order before then that the orders will be delivered on the 11th and you can get a flyer from the lunch room and order in the lunch room. I'm just gonna... Or before... Thanks Chris, we will be back after this message from the doghouse. Hey guys, it's Annabelle and Poppy from the MCHS doghouse. We have new cooling towels in stock and drip hoodies. Don't forget to come Come by on Thursday morning at 7.20 for iced coffee. Also, don't forget to follow us on Instagram and TikTok at MCHS Doghouse. Welcome back. Tonight, the basketball teams are back in action. Here's Michael with the details. Tonight, there's a couple games at home. Basketball, girls is at 6, boys is at 7, and they're going to be versing Richmond County. Thanks, Michael. One more trip to the soccer field before we get done with sports. Tonight, um, soccer is having a season opening at North Oconee High School. The girls at 5.30 p.m. and the boys at 7.30. Mascots can show up to support our soccer team. Thanks for that, Gabe. Thursday, the tennis team has a match at home against Clark Central. They will be playing at the courts across the street from the middle school. Mask up and show up to support the tennis team. Now let's get back to Angel for some more news. Driver's license by Olivia Rodrigo has been number one for the three weeks on the Billboard Hot 100 list. Good Days by Siza is moving back to the top on the Billboard chart. Meanwhile, Mood by 24K Golden featuring Ian Dore is number two on Billboard Hot 100 list. Taking the place of 34-35 by Ariana Grande, which was number two last week. A Quiet Place Part 2 is the upcoming sequel to A Quiet Place released in 2018. The movie is about what it's like being in a world where there's being monstered with heightened hearing, making it matter about how much noise you will make. The sequel movie will have the family members adventure out into the world and will have them find out that there are more than just monsters out there that they have to worry about. The movie releases into theaters on September 17, 2021. In February, Netflix is adding a bunch of new shows and movies. Mo one movie that is said to be the most popular is to All the Boys, Always and Forever. This will start streaming on February 12th. Others movies to expect are National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation and The Conjuring 1 and 2. Catch these movies and more coming out on Netflix this month. Earlier today, EA announced that they would be bringing back their college football game. The game will feature over 100 teams with their uniforms, traditions, and playbooks in the game. Unfortunately, the game is still in early dev development, and EA has not released a date when the game will come out or when the announcement for the game's release will come out. Let's wrap, let's wrap up the show with a couple of weather jokes to warm up on the way out the door. What we'll falls in the winter but never gets hurt? Snow. Here's one on more for you. Staying with the tea team from yesterday, what's a snowman's favorite drink? Iced tea. That does it for today's show. Come out and support the soccer and bas basketball team tonight. Jo join us for tomorrow for scores and highlights from the soccer matches and basketball games and much more. Have a great afternoon and, and, and as always, go dogs.